Hey YouTube, I have some horrible news. One of, one of my pigs, Bella, she died last night. And it's horrible. That isn't her, but it looked the most like her. She just so free and wild and taken so young. We don't know what disease she had, but she just died. And so I don't know if I'll be able to play Roblox. Because she just really changed my life in so many different ways. And I just miss her so much. I expect her whenever I met my dad just to come running up to say hello. And the thing I feel so bad about is I never got to say goodbye. I didn't get to say goodbye, Bella, or anything. So now I just have Sonny, and he's really nice, but I don't think he could ever replace Bella. And it's got to be hard on my dad's family, but I just wanted to let you guys know that. So if I don't, if I don't post videos as much, it's probably because I'm just trying really hard not to break down into tears <laughs> because it's like the real loss like the first real loss I've ever felt because <laughs> I really forged a bond with her <laughs> I remember she just stole my heart and <laughs> I should have made a video of her sooner <laughs> I have nothing to remember <laughs> but <laughs> I'll upload the only videos I have of her on which are on my iPod. <laughs> and maybe you'll understand why I really love her. But anyways, I, I just wanted to make this video to tell you guys that this horrible thing has happened and I might not make videos anymore <laughs> because she was just so much part of my life. And I'm trying really hard not to break down anymore, but it's really hard. Just, it's when I got the news, it just took a while to kick in that I would never get to see her walk around and oink and try to eat my hair or something better. When I never get to play with her. I snuggle with her on the couch anymore, watching Babe and Charlotte's Web, and those are some things I wanted to do with her, and now I can't. So it's like, my world kept on crashing down. The one thing though is, I never got to say goodbye to her. When she was sick, my dad rushed us out the door, and I only got one last look at her, alive. <laughs> And she was in so much pain, but she died on her own, like, with like any, we didn't put her to sleep, and I just received news of it, so it's breaking my heart, and you guys might have thought I was lying about the whole pig thing, but I'm not, why would I cry about something that meant so much to me, and you guys would have loved her, you really would have, and I'll, I can try to post um, an earlier video I have of her, but it's not much. It was her when she was little, and we, she wasn't even a year old, and we only had her for like five months. And so, it's like, this grief consumed me. I mean, sure, she wasn't human. And sure, she caused a mess, but she was part of my family. And when a family member dies, it's like your world comes dumpling down. And on top of that, Frizzle and Go Girls unfriended me, so I'm just in so much grief, pain, and I just feel alone. Like nobody would understand. And it's just. It's like, when you have one of those moments where, why does this happen to me? 
But I'm not having it though that moment. It's just why did it, my, it happen to my pig? She was like she was my niece because my stepbrother owned her and I got to be an aunt and I painted her hooves and put tutus on her and we watched this really funny big song and then Sunny came along and we're just fostering him and so it's not like I really own him. So I don't have any more like little piggies that are that are just gonna be like there's no way to explain but I might not make videos for a while because this is just really painful to me and if you guys don't understand I, I'm gonna post a bit of her and yeah so that's all I have to say that's pretty much it